Brenda here from Roaming and Recording. Today we're thrilled to take you on a virtual tour through our adventures in Cadiz, Spain. Nestled in Western Europe, Cadiz holds a rich tapestry of history dating back to its origins as a trading outpost. By the 18th century, it had blossomed into Spain's principal harbor, serving as a virtual nexus for trade with the Americas until the 1778. Our cruise ship docked conveniently at the heart of the city, allowing for easy exploration on foot. Eager to immerse ourselves in the local culinary scene, we embarked on a delightful chef's tour of the renowned Central Market. Here, amidst the bustling stalls of fishmongers, farmers, bakers, cheesemongers, locals converge not only to shop, but also to savor tapas and to share moments with friends and neighbors. Guided through the labyrinth streets of the old town, we marveled at Cadiz's architectural splendors. The majestic cathedral of Cadiz, with its gilded roof gleaming in the sunlight, commanded our attention as it dominated the skyline. Meanwhile, the vibrant town square bustled with activity, with restaurants teeming with patrons, indulging in the city's gastronomic delights. Walking through the city streets, my gaze was drawn upwards, captivated by the intricate ba balconies adorned with glimpses of city life and artistic expression. After a stroll of about a mile, we finally reached our most anticipated destination, the Central Market. The Central Market in Cadiz is not just a place to shop for ingredients. It's a whirlwind of excitement and culinary discovery. As you navigate through the maze of stalls, you're greeted by a symphony of colors, sounds, and aromas. From the banter of vendors hawking their freshest catches to the tantalizing displays of exotic fruits and spices, there is so much to see. The seafood is truly astounding in freshness, quality, and variety. Growing up in Florida, I thought I was pretty seafood savvy, but there were so many new things to discover here. I'm not even sure what some of them are. I mean, what is this fish and how the heck do you cook it? Leave me a comment below if you know. We loved watching the local shop and about noon, all the small tapas vendors on the perimeter opened up and the crowds began to pour in. At this point, it was time to follow the ship's chefs to the restaurant for a private lunch of tapas a little further down towards the coast. We dined at the El Faro restaurant. This was a favorite of Pierce Bronson and Halle Berry when filming the James Bond movie, Die Another Day. The food and wine was locally sourced and produced with much of the seafood coming in from the market we had just visited. Two outstanding tapas were the grilled octopus with paprika infused potatoes and the shrimp fritters, which is a local specialty dish. We enjoyed every moment of our time in Cadiz. It's a city with a rich and vibrant past and present. If you found this video interesting, would love it if you gave us a thumbs up as it helps our channel. If you love to hear about travel, then please consider subscribing. We're on a mission to share the world and what we learn along the way to help inspire your next big adventure. See you next time.